Now, I think the main lesson to be learned from the success of BFO-based ontology development, in, particularly in the biological world, is that if you have large numbers of people using an ontology framework, then there is accumulation of knowledge on the part of those people so that the framework becomes better. The, the teaching tools become more sophisticated. The number of people who are uh, familiar with the principles which need to be applied becomes larger, and so they can help other people to apply them more correctly. And also, most importantly, the ontologies themselves become better because if you have multiple users, then they find errors, and then you have the opportunity to correct the errors, and then the ontology gets better because of those corrections. And the gene ontology is now much larger than it was when it was first created, precisely because all of those thousands of users of the gene ontology are confronting real data about biological phenomena on a daily basis. And when they can't find a correct, correctly defined gene ontology term for a given phenomenon, then they will request from the editors that a corresponding term be added to the ontology. And this is another argument why users, having lots and lots of users, is an indispensable criterion for having a, an ontology which is not only good, but also evolving into something which is even better. Uh, so something like the Perse Wilkins ontology that John described will only be able to evolve into something better as soon as he's able to recruit even one user. Um, and I still am making the bet that in five years' time, he will not have recruited even one user. One, first of all, it's uh, just something that I cooked up uh, just very recently. I originally only had Wilkins. And it's only but, but John, you said it was the best ontology you'd ever seen. Yes. So you can't have I, it both ways. You can't, I, you can't I, I, make I, the I, excuse that it was just something you cooked up a few minutes ago and then say I, I, the best I, I, ontology I, I, you've ever seen. I, I, I am saying that I include everybody's ontology under it, and everything that you have said about VFO fits perfectly, beautifully into uh, this ontology as a special case, as an approximation to this. Now, the point is that uh, what I'm, uh, I, I agree that I have to uh, take those labels and show precisely how they map into very nice, formally defined uh, top level. I also point, however, that BFO has a huge amount of users that has added a lot of what one might call encrustation that it does not belong where it does. The information artifact ontology, all that information about uh, affordances and so on, those are all information things that belong on the left-hand side. Anything that deals with information, anything that deals with signs, anything that deals with the paper shuffling, with the uh, electron shuffling in a data computer, all of that is semiotic. All of that belongs on the left-hand side. Okay, and, then. Uh, so, in other words, in other words, you agree that the BFO, IAO, and so forth are not, in fact, specializations of your Perth Wilkins uh, universal best ontology. I would say that, I would it's because say we put the things on the wrong side. So it's, Every you, ontology is an approximation. And if it's not an approximation, then it is extremely brittle and it cannot be used for more than but one teeny weeny tiny B, application. BFO has existed now for 14 years and it's, hard, it's changed hardly at all. The gene and, ontology has existed for 20 years. It's been I'm used by thousands of people. And I'm it's not it's brittle. Level, it's, it's not. Irrelevant. It's totally so you irrelevant. say all ontologies of type X. Yes. Both of you. I think we've covered this enough. It's not something burning. <laughs> <laughs> we don't want to. We don't to start, start on fire. Okay. Uh, so if you want to say that a given ontology, say the Peirce-Wilkins cubed ontology, is higher up the tree than another ontology, say BFO, then you have to provide a true path connecting the lower to the higher. I, I, I John, John, John doesn't tend to do that detailed work. I will do that. I will do that. I will do that. He, he loses his temper instead. And so that's that. the difference. That's the difference. I will do that. Okay. Okay, I will come back in five years and see if you did it. I'll do that tomorrow. All right, I think we've okay, we've addressed that and uh <clears throat> we've run out of